Okay, so we're asked to round to three significant figures. So what I'd try and do first is write the number down. Now, with significant figures, we start counting at the start of the number. We don't start counting the decimal point. So I'm going to start counting here. And I'm going to count one, two, three, and I'm going to draw a line down. Now, all the numbers to the right of that line are going to reset to zero. But before they do, we need to look at this number, and this is called our decider number. If that number that I've circled in blue is 5 or more, it means the 7 goes up to 8. If it's less than 5, the 7 stays the same. Now, because it is 5, that 7 will go to an 8. Now, be careful here. The numbers to the right don't disappear, and some students, when they've done decimal places, um, they think they just go away. With significant figures, you have to remember that they turn to zero. Now they do the same with decimal places, it's just because they're after the decimal point, we don't need them anymore. But these three zeros here are what we call placeholders. So, for instance, if you're asked to estimate the size of a crowd, and there was 207, uh, sorry, 207,518 people, you wouldn't say that that was roughly 208 people. You would say that's roughly 208,000 people.